another little trick that I don't know if everybody knows, but in order to make your own images, uh, you can see this top loader is one that's just from a picture that I just went in and cut it out. And same with the Bordens. If I just take this down here, it's going to overwrite that one. But I'll hit OK. I'll just click that one. And then I've got this Bordens logo that has nothing around it. So that's a quick little thing for the Cricut that I think uh, not many people know. I've seen them go through a lot of work to get these images. Here's another one you can see that I've just taken a transmission and it had a lot of stuff around the photo and I just cropped it and threw it in here. So that's how I'll make a lot of my quick little images. Yeah, that's all there is to it. So if I wanted to take this car, I could take this, we'll upload it into, upload the image, browse, uh, let's just take something like, uh, let's just take this car, do a complex, boom, and I'm not going to be detailed at all, I'm just going to be very rough here, but um, you can do your wand, advanced, do, uh, do 50 or so, and then click the grass, and click this, and click this, and then we'll come back in with our big eraser and like I said this isn't going to be pretty but alright so now we've got a cut out image whatever image you use to cut out is fine so boom and then I just take instead of using the cut image I just take that boom it uploads you can see, then I'll just take this and drag this into another folder. It's going to overwrite the Bordens because it's still that uh, higher, higher, large composite. But I do that, and then boom, I've got that image separated that I can take and throw into Snappa and do whatever I want. So you can take Im any image, any anything you want to cut out of an image and throw it into a Snappa to make a thumbnail, to make anything on YouTube. Uh, and that's kind of what I did with this to do the Borden's logo. And let's get back to our canvas here. And that's what I did to make the Borden's too. So a um, couple quick little tips there in, in the old Cricut design space. So um, that's all I got on that for now.